on stage, we have sixth grade band. We'd like to play two pieces for you this evening, first of which is Bunker Hill Overture.
Oh yeah, I came prepared. Um, <clears throat> words can't possibly describe how amazing you are, like really, at all. Um, I have never, oh my god, I'm cheating so much. <laughs> um, I've, I've never looked forward to a class more than I have looked forward to um, walking into the music room every day. Um, when I walk into the music room, my first thought is, oh man, this is going to be the best part of my day. It's going to be amazing. A lot, of, a lot of you guys sitting out there right now um, probably don't understand really how just incredibly awesome Mrs. Canner is. Um, there have been so many days where I was like really upset or and not really ready to do a whole lot, but when but within the hour that I have in the music room, um, whether Mrs. Canner really noticed it or not, she made me laugh or smile or something, and it made me feel a lot better that day. Um, she not only makes her students feel better, though, she um, also encourages them to do their best, and she puts up with some seriously crazy students, and I'm looking at you, Connor. <laughs> um, so I'm going to end on a really cheesy few things. Thanks for the memories, Mrs. Kanner, and don't stop believing. <laughs>
the process started. I text Kat and I think I woke her up to like <laughs> see what she thought. And then this whole thing got set in motion. And can you close your eyes for a second? <laughs> this whole gift got set in motion from that day on. And we've been working so hard to make a gift that's worthy of you, and nothing can be as worthy as you. But we think this might um, do a little bit of the trick. And if you'll open your eyes, I'd like to present the Mrs. Canner Music Mosaic. It's going to be hung outside the music room. We just decided to make this, and the other thing is there's been a pint of my blood in that, so I got a few cuts.